Hello guys, Tevik here and welcome back to Agrarian Skies. We are on episode 3 and I fenced over this so I didn't have to walk into it all the time. But in this episode, let's craft us a furnace. A slab furnace, nonetheless, it's a furnace. And with that we can actually start smelting up these. Which we're gonna need a lot of. So let me get that stack. Gonna need a full stack of wood in there, so might as well. Whoa. Oh. And as usual, I continue with this. The basic idea for smelting stuff is to make sure that you use um, uh, sticks when it's just single items. We don't want to waste the coal that we get, but we need it for torches, so. I'm gonna make a full stack so I can make more later. Um, because the torches keep me alive. Oh yes. Did I get saplings? Yes I did. So, now that we have that furnace, we really don't need to make more stone out of dirt. Why? You might ask. Well, because once this is done, I will have a cobble gen. There we go. Let's just put that in there and let it cook for a while. And I can make myself some of these. 8, 12, yeah. I'm just gonna make a few torches right now. It's gonna be 4 torches, but it's very important. I switch on the overlay for light. I'll place one in the middle there. That means I need to place torches in the corners as well. Uh, it's actually gonna be... There. Thank you. And in that corner there. Oh, dear lord, that's not good. Now, we need to be smart. <sighs> We can knock them off of this platform. Go away. Go away. Go away. And I see creepers up there. Yeah, I should not have walked so far away from my home. Um, that creeper has seen me. He's gone. He's seen me. Oh, there are two of them. Oh dear, he's stuck. Oh, he's gone. <sighs> he's gone. That took a lot of my health though. Well, not my health, but my food level. Whew. I made some bread. And now is a good time to cook this. This is what I'll be living on. Or off, rather. Um, cooked bread makes... Toast. And toast gives me two, which is excellent. I love it. Don't we all just love toast? Yep, yes we do. And once I have this now, I have so I can survive. Let's put in the unfired crucible. And the unfired clay bucket as well. The crucible I want to play somewhere smart. Mm. For now, do I have space for two? No, not really. But I can place one of these down there. I will need to make more torches. Let me get that. Actually, I don't have wood for that, do I? No. Well, oh, yes, I do. Okay. I got a clay bucket. Excellent. I'm gonna do some shifting around with some stuff here. And uh, that's enough for a bunch of torches. Now let's not repeat this creeper incident. I made stairs up here so I can get up here. Oh. I don't want to jump. Praise the road. Praise it now. I'll put a torch on it. I'll leave it there. We need to get on top of the roof as well. 
But for now, <clears throat> sorry, just let's make sure that we have this all lit up all over the place. The whole island needs to be lit. Because if it isn't, bad stuff will spawn. And once this is done, I think we're good. Jumping is bad, I know. Yeah, we're good. It's just the roof, but that's all right. We can handle it. Right, with the clay bucket, I can be a bit smart about this. And let's um, place down. Let's expand this a little bit. Oh, a tree grew. That's excellent. Saves bone meal. That's good. There we go. Uh, is this one lit? Hmm. There we go. If I take these and move them a bit, I want to make a water pool that is three by three. You can put the torch there and there, and that should be enough. Why do I make it like this? Well, with this clay bucket, I can go up to my pond up here. Pick that up. We're good. I need to get one more of these. It's always good to have a permanent source of water. Believe me. Um, you will need it. But the good thing is, if I'm smart about this... can do this. Perfect. Now I can stand here. I can pick up water from there and fill these and make clay. Clay is something we're gonna need a lot of. Then we need the next thing. I'm gonna need to make some more... Ah. I do have some dirt, so I could probably get one of those. With a torch there, with the crucible on top, I need a total of four. Yeah, so we're not gonna have enough. I need a total of four uh, stone. Four stone, you say? Well, yes. It smelts down, so we got two, into a bucket of lava. And a lava bucket will really, really help us make a, a cobble generator in an easy way. I will show you once we have that. So let me just punch some trees or get some more saplings. Oh, melon seeds. We need to set this up real quick. There's a reason for this. And that's food. Melons a very good source of food. Because it grows quite big. So, I'll fix that once I have some more dirt, I think. Um, yeah. Anyhow, let me do this, and I'll be back with you in a moment. So, I have my stones. Two, three, and four. That torch under there will make it very, very, very slow. But, it works. Believe me, it does work. Now, I need to start designing the whole thing. No, not that one. We go. Um, how I'll do this is a bit hmm, not sure yet, but I think I'm gonna place it down here. If I place the lava block there, have this empty, and this, uh, I need to be careful so I don't actually cause issues with this. Um, uh, cobble generator. I can't remember the good way to do this. I'm just browsing on a site here, just to the side on this screen. Yeah. I th think I need to make it... I'll put the lava there. I'll dig a 
hole there. And then I will put the water here. That will be good. And then with the lava there, it will break and yeah, that will be excellent. Probably not the smartest place to put this. That might actually work better. No. Silly me. Get the water back. Get that done. So, I'm gonna be waiting for this for quite a while. And uh, once it's done, well, we'll be doing some stuff. Let's get... I don't have a lot of bone meal left. But... I need more of this, so... Because I need a lot of dirt. And unfortunately, tree... Uh, tree farming is the only way, really, to get that done. So... What I have to do is spend a lot more time doing this. Just destroying trees. So, I'll check up on this uh, crucible up there in a while and see if it's done. So, I'll see you then. And I see lava. Now, I revised this. The lava cannot touch... Uh, the source block of the lava cannot touch water. So, uh, let's get this and let's hope I get a bucket. Now, it's a bit more smelting that needs to be done. But, oh, look, another tree. You get so happy about trees growing in this, it's almost funny. It's true, you really do. Now you're laughing at me. Stop laughing at me. You're not supposed to laugh at me. I'm supposed to be laughing at you. No, wait, I'm not supposed to be laughing at you. I'm la supposed to be laugh w laughing with you. Yeah, so, um... Skyblock. What do you think so far? Let me know in the comments. And, uh... If you do like it, do remember to tell your friends about it, and, uh, yeah, um, I really like this. And, by the way, I should throw out, uh, uh, real kudos to the makers of this map, and that's a lot of people. Let me just get the, um, map information about it here. It's Jaded Cat who is the main, um, well, the main uh, designer, um, and uh, on that more Valaria, Joshi, Erasmus, Zero Cuny, Skyboy, uh, DSWE, Lord Dusk, Scott Wears, Mysterious Ages. I don't know who that is, and all the testers. Uh, that's the credits for it. Um, you can find this if you search just for Agrarian Skies. Um, and uh, you can find uh, all the information you need about it and how to download it. You need the FTB uh, launcher and from there you can just choose it. I chose the 2.0. It's not the recommended, I think. But it's uh, up to you if you want to go recommended or not. So, one more dirt. Hooray! I will place it down here. Um, there, and I will break these, and I will plant the melon here. Oh, I'm gonna use this one. I want the melons growing, because melons are good. Plus, later on we can make a fruit salad. Hooray! With melons. Um, these microblocks are great, but, um, I use slabs for now, and... 70%, 80%. We are losing health food. I'm gonna eat the beef jerky. There's gonna be a little bit at least. It's about half a heart, I think. Or half a T-bone. I don't know. Let's see if that lava is done. Looks done? Still not. What? What are you doing? You're supposed to be working. Let's uh, sift this one and make one more cobble and put in there. See if that works. So once I get cobblestone, I can start making other stuff. So it's very important that I get it and uh, get a cobble generator going as quickly as possible because it's very, very important for me. And 
I'll be standing there, just hitting in that direction. Um, I could probably make a opening there, or just place a bit of cobble there, just to be sure. Um, anything that doesn't burn and takes a bit of time, because... Um, well, it takes a bit of time to hack through, because I don't want to accidentally make a hole. Um, did we get stairs? Can I use this for anything? No, I can smelt stuff with it. That's not what I meant. Um, I need to do this. Uh, I don't want to spend too much on making uh, wheat grow. Because I will be farming this later. I think I'm going to make this area my farm. It's a good place. Uh, it's as good a place as any, really. Uh, and uh, didn't I have one more of these left? Yes. Excellent. Excellent. Now three of these can be smelted up with six of these. More torches. Hooray. And come on, do we have that? I want to show you. Yes. Now this will double. As let's see, pick a misfortune or the one I want the one that I level up, but it's stomach, so I don't think I can repair it. Let me just take a look and see. Can I repair it? Um, I need the tool um, station. Um, doesn't say what materials you have, unfortunately. What about this one? No. Mining level stone. So it's not really good for anything. So if it breaks, it's not that much of trouble. But. Wood. No. Stone. And once I can make stone, everything will be a lot smoother. We have a cobble generator. Can we turn anything in? Yes, I can claim a reward. So one, two, or three, uh, let's make this one. Basic one. What did I get? Jaded Princess, not bad. Actually, I could make a hive of this. Ah. Uh, a bee house, maybe. I don't have a comb. Oh. That's uh, an issue. So... Yeah, what can we do next? Uh, dust in the wind, we can make iron or gravel. I could probably do that right away. Let's try it. I think I am running a little bit over time on this episode now, aren't I? Uh, yeah, but I hope you forgive me. that I'm running over time on your episodes that you like to watch. Yeah. Okay. I need to get gravel. Uh, let me see. It's iron ore gravel, yes. So hopefully we'll get some iron ore. What do you get? Broken iron ore. I need a total of four of these, and it's totally random, so I might need to get a lot of uh, cobblestone for this. I got some appetite and some more broken stuff. Um, yeah, I'm not getting enough. <laughs> got some lapis, though. That's nice. Yeah, so I'll be spending a lot of time doing exactly that. Sifting through gravel while waiting for stuff to grow. Um, so, this is me leaving this episode. So I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time. So in the time between this and the next, I will plant more trees. Expand this. Um, aiming for an 8x8 of trees, that is, so 8 in that direction, 8 in that direction, that's a total of 64 trees that can grow, that's a very large platform, but I think I will thank myself later, because we can convert parts of it to an orchard, uh, orchard, I suppose, once I get some decent um, stuff, so 
that's it for this episode. Hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.